It's time for BCQ, the Black College Quiz. Let's meet today's contestants. My name is Jerome Bowers. I'm a junior at Allen University in Columbia, South Carolina. I'm a social sciences major. I want to give a shout out to my mentor, Dr. Kareem Muhammad. My name is India Harris. I am a senior political science major representing the Alabama State University. And I'd like to give a shout out to my family and my friends, especially my friend Taylor, who begged for a shout out. And now, here's your host, Matthew Tommy. Welcome to BCQ! Welcome to BCQ, where HBCU students show off their black history and cultural skills while competing for thousands in scholarship money. The winner of today's match goes to the quarterfinals and a chance to become the BCQ champion. Now, we've already met our contestants. They're ready for the head-to-head. -head. Y'all ready? ready? India? Jerome? Ready. Let's do it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Here we go. Top of the charts, 25 points. This smash hit written by Smokey Robinson became a career shaper for Motown great Mary Wells. India. My guy. My guy, absolutely right. <laughs> Who said it, 25 points? Who said, racism is not an excuse to not do the best you can? India. Arthur Ashe. Arthur Ashe, absolutely right. <laughs> the alumni for 50 points. Graffiti Swag Barbershop is located in what city? Jerome. Atlanta. Atlanta. Go for the gold, 50 points. Dominique Dawes is the first African American to win an Olympic bronze medal in what category? India. Gymnastics. Gymnastics. Black Pioneer, 75 points. Frederick Douglass became the first African American nominated for this United States office. Name the office. India. Vice President. Vice President. Music Influencers, 75 points. For The Temptation, this ballad broke their norm of performing socially relevant songs. Name the tune. India. Just My Imagination. Just My Imagination. Black Superhero, 100 points. Name the character that took over Peter Parker's Spider-Man mantle. India. Miles Morales. Miles Morales, absolutely right. STEM Innovators, 100 points. Kimberly Bryant started the organization Black Girl Code in what year? India. 2013. No, that is incorrect. Jerome? 2011. 2011, my man. <laughs> Literary Classics, 125 points. James Baldwin's semi-autobiographical novel was published in 1953, becoming his first major work. Name the novel. Jerome. Go tell it on the mountain. Go tell it on the mountain. <laughs> Music Influencers, 125 points. At what age did Stevie Wonder make his recording debut? India. Nine. That is incorrect. Twelve. That is incorrect as well. The correct answer is 11. Age 11, all right? All right, that's the end of our first round. Let's see what we got. <laughs> Jerome, you have 275 points, my man. Not bad, not bad at all. India, 350 points. All right, we got a lot of game left, so y'all get ready. Coming up next is the rapid fire round. Rapid fire. Keep it locked right here. This is BCQ. You know it. Stay in the know with everything BCQ. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BLK College Quiz. Then make sure you like us on Facebook at Black College Quiz. Join the conversation everywhere by using the hashtag Black College Quiz. This presentation of Black College Quiz is being brought to you by State Farm. Talk to an agent today at 800 State Farm and in part by Walmart. Discover more ways to shop at Walmart today. McDonald's, black and positively golden. Join and follow on Instagram at We Are Golden. What did the police see when they see me? Do they see their daughter? Do they see their neighbor? Do they see a college graduate? Or do they just see a threat? Here's what I think that they don't see, my humanity. Police training should always include one simple lesson. If they don't see us as we are, their actions can have consequences. Welcome back to BCQ! 
<laughs> Welcome back to BCQ. Today, we are repping Tuskegee University, an Alabama institution. It's the home of Booker T. Washington, George Washington Carver, and the heroic Tuskegee Airmen. For more on the Golden Tigers' contribution to America, visit tuskegee.edu. That's tuskegee.edu, all right? Let's pick up the pace. It's time for the rapid fire round. First up is Jerome. Jerome, come on out here. Jerome. Woo! Woo! I say Jerome's in the house. <laughs> Watch your back. <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm good. You I'm good? good. You good? What yes, you majoring in? I'm a social science major with a pre-law studies concentration. Okay, okay. I don't know what none of that means, Jerome. <laughs> All right? They tell me you have a non-profit business called Constant Elevation. Yes, sir. Tell Constant me about Elevation it. Elevation Community Development Group. We tutor youth in the community. We offer free tutoring and mentoring services for youth ages 5 to 17. Really? That's yes, good. That's real good. All right. You ready to make your students proud? Yes, sir. All right, let's do it, man. Here we go. Here we go. Category. All about Mary Churchill Terrell. Okay? All about Mary Churchill Terrell. Start the clock. True or false? Terrell focused much on her attention on women's rights to vote. True. True or false? She was the first African-American woman ever appointed to a school board. True. She became the first president of the National Association of Colored Women in, 19, in, in 1896 or 1893. 1896. She was a character member of the SCLC or NAACP. NAACP. What major city did she help pass a ruling that ended segregated restaurants in that city? Baltimore, Maryland. What year was she refused service in a whites-only restaurant? Pass. Terrell served on a committee that investigated alleged mistreatment of African Americans by who? Pass. What year was she refused service in a whites-only restaurant? Pass. Terrell served on a committee that investigated alleged mistreatment of African Americans by who? Time is up. All right, Jerome. How you think you did, man? Uh, yeah. That's yeah. all right. That's all right. We'll see. All right. You go that way. Miss India, you come this way. <laughs> we in the middle of the rapid fire. How you doing? I I'm great. How are you? Good. You? Let me see. Born and raised in the same town you went to school in. You're going to school in. Mm -hmm. Well, sort of. I was born in Marion, Alabama, which is where is where my university was founded. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. That's where the university was founded. Is that where mm -hmm. the university is now? No. Oh, it's moved. Mm -hmm. Alabama State University is now in Montgomery, Alabama. Okay. What are you majoring in? Political science. Go on. You're going to be a lawyer? That's the plan. That's the plan. Yeah. All right, then. And the plan right now is rapid fire. Yeah. All right, let's get it going. Here we go. Mm -hmm. All about Mary Church Terrell. All about Mary Church Terrell. Start the clock. True or false? Terrell focused much on her attention on women's rights to, to vote. True. True or false? She was the first African-American woman ever appointed to a school board. True. She became the first president of the National Association of Colored Women in 1896 or 1893. 93. She was a charter member of the SCLC or NAACP. SCLC. What major city did she help pass a ruling that ended segregated restaurants in that city? Washington, D.C. What year was she refused service in a whites-only restaurant? 1962. Terrell served on a committee that investigated alleged mistreatment of African Americans by who? Time is up. Time is up. That's all right. That's all right, Andy. That's all right. Come on back out here, Jerome. This is rapid fire, baby. All right. I'll read the questions again, and I'll give you the answers, okay? Here we are. All about Mary Church Terrell. All about Mary Church Terrell. True or false? Terrell focused much of her attention on women's rights to vote. The answer is true. True or false? She was the first African-American woman ever appointed to a school board. The answer is true. She became the first president of the National Association of Colored Women in 1896 or 1893. The correct answer is 1896. 
She was a charter member of the SCLC or NAACP. The correct answer is NAACP. What major city did she pass a ruling that ended segregated restaurants in that city? The correct answer is Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. What year was she refused service in a whites-only restaurant? The correct answer, 1950. All right. Terrell served on a committee that investigated alleged mistreatment of African Americans by who? The correct answer, police. The police. All right, let's see what we got. My man, Jerome, here we go. You got four out of seven. Four out of seven you got. That brings your score to a total of 475 points. 475. <laughs> India. Yeah. All right, now, you got three out of seven. Three out of seven, bringing your score to 500 points. 500 points. <laughs> it's tied up in here. All right, after the break, the coaches will come up and they're going to help their students get a little bit more points, all right? This is the You Should Know round. Tune in. BCQ. You know. The Black College Girls will return after these messages. We've all seen it, and we've all gotten it. Procter & Gamble presents The Look. It's time for You Should Know. It's the You Should Know round. That's where the students get support from the coaches, and the coaches are here. Welcome, welcome. Thank you. All right, how you, Miss yeah. Cynthia Ashley Harris, how you doing? I'm wonderful. How about you? I'm good. What do you do at Alabama State University? I am the director of the W.E.B. Du Bois Honors Program. The W.E.B. Du Bois Honors Program. All right, girl. <laughs> and you're also an ordained minister. I am. All right. How long you been ordained? Since 2007. All right. Yes. All right. You 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 have service where? Uh, in Prattville, Alabama. I live in Montgomery, and it's about 10 minutes. 10 from minutes? Montgomery. All yes. right. 10 minutes. You shouldn't be late for church, right? Never. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We have Dr. Kareem R. Muhammad here from Allen University. How you doing? I'm doing great, bro. How are you? I'm good. What do you do at the school? I'm the Dean of Business, Education, and Social Sciences, and uh, I teach sociology and criminal justice. Okay. All right. Not bad at all. All right. Hosted a hip-hop radio show when you was in college. Yes. Mm. Like, back in the day. Right, like five years ago. Five years? Right. Oh, five years, whatever. <laughs> 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 All right, it's that time. Up first is Alabama State Hornets. Alabama State Hornets, take your positions. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> let's go, India. All right, category is Samuel L. Jackson. Samuel L. Jackson. All right, you ready? Ready. Got your horn's face on? Horn's face on. All right, here we go. <laughs> Three, two, one, start the clock. All right, long black jacket, long Check. black leather. Yes. Mm, all right. Uh, this is something that your parents tell you never to do that's religious. You don't want to do this uh, when you're, when you're, it's a bit. Sin. Keep going. When you don't tell the truth. Lie. Sinful lie. Uh, Pass. Tell the truth. Pass, yes. Okay. 
Okay, his head is. <laughs> Shaped. His head is. Bald. Yes. Mm. Okay, uh, 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 this is this is the movie we watched last night. Django and Chain. Yes. Okay, uh, he also did this. This is a, a piece of metal. It's really hard. This is the movie he did with a piece of metal. It's really, really hard. Unbroken. No. Piece of metal that's really hard. It's, yes, it's 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 a, it's a hard piece of metal and and uh, pass. Let's go back. Okay. Um, animated? No. What's wrong? Frozo? No. Frozen? No. This is this is this is. Um, Time is up. Uh, Time is up. Sorry. It's all right. It's all right. Y'all have a seat. Uh, Whoa. Oh, so, so Cynthia? Yes. It was, um, tell her what it was. You forgot that fan. Yes, well, the last one was Nick Fury. Nick Another Fury. One. Nick Iron Fury Man. was his name. Iron Man. The first one, the hard piece of metal was, was Iron. Iron. She was trying to get you to say Iron Man. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. She gonna, she gonna. Well, yeah. Oh, I said there's something that you do. I do it's all right. Clothes it's all okay. right. Think of everything. It's okay, it's okay. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna pray on it. Yes. We're gonna pray on yes, it. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> all right, up next, we have uh, Alan Yellow Jackets. It's the Yellow Jackets. Let's go. Take your position. <laughs> all right, Jerome's in the house. The category is When They See Us. When they see us. All right? Three, two, one. Jerome, let's go. Um, the, the location where it happened. Central Park. Mm. The director. Ava DuVernay. All right. Um, what was she doing? Um, the, uh, the... Jogger. <laughs> um, one of the main actresses, uh, she played one of the mothers. Um... Steve, um, pass. Mm -hmm. Um, the, the place where the, the boys lived. New York. More specific. Spanish. Spanish Harlem. Uh, the oldest cat, his, uh, his, his real name. Corey Wise. <laughs> pass. Ooh, mm. I, I could've did. Yeah, pass, pass, pass. Um, what, what, what do they call? All them together, the boys. The Central Park Five. The, uh, the, the... Time is up. Ah. Time is up. Time is up. Have a seat, have a seat. The Exonerated. What's the Exonerated Five? Exonerated That's the five. new one. Yeah, exonerated yeah, Five. And then the one... That one but I wasn't quite what's the sure. one you passed on? It was a name you passed on. Jarrell Jerome. Jarrell Jerome. Right. And his name's Jerome. Right. I thought about it after. <laughs> yeah. I <could've>... Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, let's see what we got. Alabama State Hornets, you got three correct. Three correct, bringing your total score to 650 points. 650 points, all right? All right, here we go. And the Allen Yellow Jackets, you got five correct, bringing your score to 725 points. It's still tight. It's real tight. All right, you know what time it is. It is time now for the wager round. The wager round. This is where students can choose to bid none, some, or all of their points on our final question. Today's wager round category is who said it? Who said it? All right, so students, pick up your tablets. Get ready to write down what you're going to bid for your wager. And when we come back, we will be in the middle of the wager round. This is BCQ. You know it. Yeah. The Black College Girls will return after these messages. What do the police see when they see me? Do they see their son? Do they see their neighbor? Do they see a college graduate? Or do they just see a threat? Here's what I think they don't see my humanity. Police training should continuously include one simple lesson. If they don't see us as we are, their actions can have consequences. Welcome back. The winner of today's game will advance to the quarterfinals and have a chance to keep getting that scholarship money. But first, Let's see how everything goes with the wager round question, all right? After I read it, students, you have 15 seconds to write down the answer. Here is the question. Who said it? Who said 
The best way to guarantee a loss is to quit. Start the clock. Who said the best way to guarantee a loss is to quit? Cornell West, A. Philip Randolph, Morgan Freeman, Asasta Shakur. Clock is ticking. India got 650. Jerome got 725. It's tight up in here. Real tight. Mm hmm. Time is up. The question was who said the best way to guarantee a loss is to quit? Cornell West, A. Philip Randolph, Morgan Freeman, Asada Shakur. The correct answer is Morgan Freeman. Morgan Freeman. All right, let's see what we got. Jerome, you were sitting on 725 points. You wagered 300 points. And your answer is A. Philip Randolph for 300 points. You wagered 300. You are down to 425 points. All right, let's go to India. India, you were sitting on 650 points. Show me your wager and your answer. Morgan Freeman for the whole 650. 1,300 points. India is the winner of BCQ today. Give it up. Woo! Wow, wow, wow. Jerome, play well, my man. We're not going to let you go home empty-handed. So I got some scholarship money for you as well, all right? All right, all right, all right. That's our time. Until next week, I'm your boy, Nephew Tommy, for Black College Quiz. BCQ! You know it. This presentation of Black College Quiz has been brought to you by State Farm. Talk to an agent today at 800-STATE-FARM. And in part by Walmart. Discover more ways to shop at Walmart today. McDonald's, black and positively golden. Join and follow on Instagram at wearegolden. At P&G, we know that an equal world is a better world for everyone. Choose to end racism. Get started at pg.com backslash take on race.